No! What the fuck? What the fuck is going on? No, dodge the spider, dodge the spider. Why did I dodge it in real life? I do not know. Ah! this because I wanted to drink a little bit of wine. Alright, hook the wall, dude. I, I don't trust this water. If one of those water monsters comes out and tries to eat me, ah, fuck. See, I knew it! Wait, is it just sunlight? I don't know. Alright, let me just, um, quickly... I'm gonna need a lot of those. <laughs> Please give me this sanity potion because I've literally just gone completely insane. Uh, alright. No hope. No hope for me, guys. I'm really... Oh, hello. Ah, I need to use the ladder. What's that ladder bit? Come here. There is hope. You're giving me hope. You're giving me objects, like, ways to get out of this place. So, of course, there's hope. All right, I'm going up. This game's pretty cool, actually. I like it. It's so... It has a clear storyline. It's really messed up and strange, but that's what I like about this. And it's pretty scary too, so... It's something that you're having a nightmare, you know? Like, something so distorted and strange. It really, it really adds the uh, creepy factor to it. Like, look, look at this! I'm climbing skulls! Look at this shit! <laughs> How many custom stories allow you to climb skulls? I don't think any, so yeah, I'm, I'm pretty impressed right now. This isn't bad. Let's keep, let's keep this up. <laughs> keep this up, custom story. Oh, oh, brilliant. Isn't this just great? Statues, headless statues. I'm flying. I'm, f I was, f I was freaking flying right there, guys. Is that, is that the way out? Oh, God. Hey there, sir. <laughs> you have a small penis. <laughs> let's, uh, let's run. Please, can he, can he get out? <gasps> I thought he was like dragging me by my leg or something then. Thank you. Fuck. <laughs> oh, this is this is this is pretty good. You know, this is literally hey line I drink. What? What what? Yeah, I'm down there. No? Okay. You know, you should have gone in that room at the beginning of the game, dude. Not now? <sighs> you should have gone in there. You know, you should have stayed in bed. Wait for your landlord to come, he's probably some mutant evil twisted demon creature and everything would have been fine sir oh look rituals and shit this always happens he's got like slivering logo on, logo on him maybe it's draco malfoy hey there guys you alive they're alive isn't that beautiful you're all gonna die just saying goodbye oh isn't that isn't that great look at all these doors what if i just stand in the middle here hey oh no that box is gonna fall on my head fuck that What? I see light. Is that a way out of here? Oh. Oh, dearie me. Hey, they put a ladder down for me. And you know, I don't see <laughs> I don't see any light up there. It's pretty dark if you ask me. So, I think I'm getting trolled. This is this, this a trap. It's a trap, <laughs> guys. That's for sure. Hope you guys watch Star Wars. I know that meme. I'm sure most of you do. What is that? Oh, Jesus. What are you? Hello? Oh, it's the sexy- Hello there, sexy lady! Yeah, hello there, baby! Is that an angel? She's beautiful. Um, cool face. Hello, baby! Are you here to sa- This is what I'd say. Hello, baby. Are you here to save me? Ah! No, the you- What? You are you- Wait, what? What are you? Why am I here? Uh... Sexy lady, um... Please don't kill me. I just want to go to bed and drink more wine. Ow! You jerk! I think I just got rejected, guys. Oh, I got eaten alive as well. I just got rejected. She just slapped me across the face because I was flirting with her. I feel kind of bad. Ugh. I feel kind of bad I got rejected. I'm going to have to drink a lot more wine now. Um, I guess I should just uh, go. Isn't that... I'm going to just check down here. I won't be going back in there anytime soon. I just want to double check, um, check on the place, but I guess not. It, the wine was drugged, mate. Just saying. Oh. I hope you're okay. Oh. The moment I saw you down here, I knew you'd gotten into the previous owner's stash of self-made wine. A complete whack job, that guy was. He used all sorts of hallucinogenics. What did I say? 
Making that stuff. I planned to clear the cellar of that junk, but thought it best to consult you first. Luckily, upon seeing you crawl around the same hallway over and over, I knew you had drank one of the less dangerous ones. Some of those mixtures have some pretty nasty side effects. And nevertheless, I locked the cellar door to be safe and hung you the spare key you dropped during your ep episode behind this note. Once you've come to your senses, come on upstairs, your landlord. See, everything was just a dream or a hallucination. Everything. <laughs> You motherfucker, landlord! Give me a hug. Give me, give me a big hug. Eh. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Deep into the darkness, peering long, I stood there, wondering, fearing, doubting. Edgar Allan Poe. Hey, I, I thought it was gonna be a sad ending. I thought I was gonna go upstairs at least first, and someone was arraying me in my bed. Fuck. Who are you? How did you get here? I don't even know where here is, and why did a damn angel try to kill me? My deepest apologies. I feared you were one of those monsters wearing a human guise. I hope you guys like my female voice. I've been practicing it. Tell me how you got here. I don't know. Where are you and where am I? I am too broken to retain a physical presence. The fuck is going on? I'm so confused, guys. Come on. I want to read a bit more. Please tell me, what is this place? A sort of void between life and death. Avoid these doors? Where do they lead? To hell. <sighs> Alright. I don't think it leads to hell, but... Hey, if that pops up, I'll, I'll lol. My time spent has broken my mind. Those doors lead to the shattered fragments of my psyche. How do I get out of this place? I believe that if my mind were to be restored, I could help you. How the fuck did I end up in this situation? Like... No wonder the place was cheap. Alright, so I just gotta go into those rooms and get your head back in order. That sounds simple. Deceptively so. Each fragment contains a piece of my mind, memories, my thoughts, my fears. They will shape each room. Some may not be safe. It seems like I don't have a choice in this matter if I want to get home. Oh my- This game is really good. This is custom story, sorry. Then hurry. Your you being here seems to be a salary to my degradation. Which room should I go to first? It doesn't matter, there are only a few open. I kept the rest closed for safety. Work on the ones that are open, I'll get the rest open. The signs above the doors tell where each lead. My god, this is awesome. This, this is awesome, I like it. Okay. Huh. Huh. Where do I begin first? Are these all locked? Yeah. So right now, we've only got two to choose, but... There's a lot of freaking doors. Uh... These are, they're all uh, very hard to read. We've got the library and the Historia room, I think. History room. Let's start, even though I was trashing on books earlier. Let's go in the library. Here we go, guys. Oh, isn't it so cute? Trees, pathways. Seems there's somebody else waiting on the bus it's my past um can i not please can i please hey are you i oh, know that's not the woman hey are you waiting for the bus too yes oh sorry if i sounded creepy just so you know i'm not a serial killer or anything that's good that's good to know i need to practice my woman voice again <clears throat> if i was i probably wouldn't look like i do and i know what a serial killer would look like so i'm an idiot oh they're gonna get married isn't that so cute Oh, that was adorable. I love that. Hey, I want to go see that woman again. She likes me. Looks like that girl from before is at the bus stop. Oh, They're going to hit it off, guys. Lady, hi there. Oh, hello again. I guess meeting here again doesn't bode well for not my not a serial killer status. I'll have to keep my eye on you. Oh, he uh, he I didn't get your, la your name last time. I'm Vincent. Hello, Vincent. Shit, I didn't get a name. I didn't read it in time. It went too fast. Um, what? Nothing. I think I love you. I've fallen in love with you the first time I laid eyes on you. Damn, it wasn't supposed to rain today. Coming back from my invisible job that I don't really work at. Trouble. Wait, where's my heart beating? Are you alright? I really don't like water. Ugh. Are you are you made of sugar or something? <laughs> what? Uh, no, I just um. You can stand under my umbrella if you want. Thank you, thank you, lady. I love you now. Anna? Huh? Her name's Anna. 
That's my name, it's my name. Oh, it's nice. What made you change your mind, Anna? Because you're big, strong arms. Jury was still out on of on your serial killer status. I see. And the verdict? I don't think a serial killer could be afraid of water. Jason Voorhead was. He knows a serial killer for some reason. You really are an idiot, aren't you? That seems to be how things work out for me. Where did it happen? When did it happen? When did I become an idiot? Or when did you become scared of water, right? No, I get the feeling that's genetic. I'm talking about the hydrophobia. I almost drowned as a child. Oh, I'm sorry. It's all right. Oh, I see the bus. I like how they know these big words. They're so smart. So intelligent. Ah, well, it was nice to see you again. You too. Damn it, Vincent. Make a move. Just ask her out already. Wait. This is my sparing brother. You can have it if you walk me. If you'll walk me home. Sure. Thanks. Oh. Oh yeah, Vincent. You the man. You the man, Vincent. Most people who know me are aware that I have certain phobia of water, but when I met you, you shelter me from the storm, both the real one and the one in my head. When I'm with you, I'm not afraid anymore. You offer me protection from the rain, and I promise to show you every day that even though I may be prone to childish fears, I love you more than anything in the world. Oh, this is so adorable. This is so beautiful. And she, I think she's dead. Well, isn't that just great? Is that, is that a funeral or something? Is she dead? Is that a brain? What is that? What is this? Oh, it's a fragrant. My god, that was cheesy. I never knew I could be guilty of such hyperbole. I'm such an idiot. Well, you're my idiot, and I think it's cute when you ramble. Aww. This is amazing. And there's one done. I have no piece. I only have one piece, actually. So far, your memories have been rather happy. How how you wind up in a place like this? I can't remember. I imagine the same way you did. Hopefully, these fragrances will help us both figure that out. Well, I only got the one piece, so I'll go in here now and check the, the second one. Let's have a gander, shall we? Happy music again. I'm going to have to probably mute all this. Uh, do not leave your room for the rest of the night, Michael. Michael, his prominent childhood memory is being grounded. <laughs> oh, I've been a naughty, naughty boy. I will say. Good on, Michael. Can't, can't complain about this, dude. Maybe I can find a way to get out of that window. I need some stuff to climb down with, though. I need, like, a rope or something. Or I could use the bed sheet, right? Or the pillows. You know, they did an, um... What's that uh, thing? Oh, I need this knife. Come here. Boom! I'm trashing my room. Don't ask why a, a kid has a dagger in his room. Like, you know what? Who gives a shit, eh? There doesn't need to be an explanation for this. I thought I was, like, crouching, but I guess I'm just tiny. <laughs> I'm just a small little ripper schnapper. Um, where's the window, exactly? Is this the window? What is this? Uh, I'm, I'm kind of confused as to where the window is. Maybe this is it. It's behind here. Dude, you don't even have a window! You fail! Oh, wait, it's actually behind this desk. I'm so silly. Um, can I please, can I please use my, my dagger of cutting and skinning, and my rope, um, okay. What the fuck am I supposed to do? Oh, I'm so hot, I'm sweating so much, Ugh. okay, now that I've got my comb over, uh, I'm gonna have to like, uh, but I figure this out within the next 30 seconds, guys, I'm gonna end this video here, and I'm gonna, uh, figure this one out off screen, unless there's something to do, I don't know what that is doing there for, it's too oddly placed for me to really grasp it. Hmm, I length a rope and a blade. And there's no point combining the two, so it's not gonna work. Got one fra fragrance. Um fucking hair in my mouth. One's love. Is this one what adventure? Like, um, or is it um cunning? Mm, um wisdom? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know why wisdom would be it. Alright, I don't I don't I don't get this one. It's a little confusing for me. The windows seem to have keys on them. Maybe I need a key. Uh, it just seems like I would be able to pick the lock with the dagger, but I guess not. And I'm not too sure where the key is placed. I can't get onto my bed. I've checked all the drawers and this um, this thing's locked. So, what I will do then, guys, unless it's behind this painting, which I doubt, but I may as well try if I can get on the chair. Uh, what I'm going to do then, guys, is I will off-screen uh, figure this one out. I hope you guys are enjoying this uh, custom story so far. It's highly likely, actually, that the key is on the bookshelf. So I will really quickly just double-check that. Um, unless it's underneath this book, which is possible. Nope. Okay. Okay, unless it's underneath. No. All right. Um... For now, then, I will call this one quits. I hope you guys enjoyed the videos. Thank you for watching. Uh, it feels great to be playing Amnesia again, I will say. Uh, so thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you all again very soon. Goodbye, everyone.